another video more specifically what I eat in a day video. My mom bought me a cake. So this right here. Start off my morning with some oxy shred. I've taken this many times. You guys know the deal. very quick disclaimer in no way shape or form am i saying if you eat like this you're going to look like me I'm not saying that you need to eat like this one eats differently depending on their own lifestyles and their own goals i love you guys so much and i hope you guys enjoy the video as you can see i finished my oxy shred made myself look a little bit more put together because when i woke up this morning it was a little rough not gonna lie also is the last monday leg day of 2022 which is kind of nuts. I can't believe 2022 is over. My first meal of the day, I'm gonna make an omelet. An easy go-to omelet. Reminds me of my childhood because my mom used to make me omelets like this. Tortilla, preferably one that has high protein. I need eggs. Optional is egg whites, baños, and some cebolla. six grams of protein per egg so I'm gonna have four tortillas I want them to get fairly crispy I like adding the tortilla because it adds a little bit more substance to my omelets and it really fills me up if you guys have been following me for a little bit you guys know that I was not consuming animal products for the longest time but up until this year I recently started reintroducing things little by little the eggs is one of the things that I recently introduced it down kind of medium low and now I'm gonna go in out of my webito salt this makes everything taste so good just a little bit I'm just gonna cover it and just let it do its thing I'm going to make some greens I am doing the guava. I will go ahead and add the benefits of creatine on the screen here so you guys know all of the deets and why I personally love to take it and have been taking it consistently for like two years. Don't waste your time trying other greens because these are the best tasting greens. This meal right here has 42 grams of protein. Even if I were to have a smoothie, my smoothie would probably be around the same amount of protein. You don't necessarily have to eat eggs or have to have this or have to have that. If there's one thing about me, it's like I'm gonna get in my protein regardless. Eating me or not, I'm getting in my protein and I've shown you guys that over the years with my what I eat in a day videos. You have a lot of options. It's just a matter of making sure that you buy high protein ingredients. So try to purchase products that are already high in protein so you don't even have to think about it too much while you're at home. But yeah, this is so good. You should always enjoy what you're eating. You just need to experiment around with like what works for you and what you personally like. 
Bussin. Bussin. I see that. Gone. Gym time. I haven't had legs in a few days and I'm just juiced. I'm just juiced. Let me go ahead and show you guys my gym fit because it's so cute. I don't know what you would call this color, but I'm wearing these Diosa Fit shorts. Gym Shark Vital Seamless shirt underneath. Really big thrifted vintage tee on top. I love it. I feel like these colors are giving 90s and I'm just really digging it. You guys know me and my fits. I always wear my jewelry, so I got that on. Got my added this some black sneakers like asics they're giving dad but you know what a dad vibe never hurt nobody let's hit this leg day oh excited so oh, i enjoy taking snacks to the gym and it honestly changes up from time to time but i am gonna go ahead and take one of these little bars mini fruit bars they're really good i'm also going to take a little bit of nuts. I really like to take bananas as a pre-workout snack. I'm gonna take that one. I get kind of lightheaded sometimes. So having some nuts and stuff like that really helps out. I'm gonna fill up my cup with water. Sometimes I take pre-workout, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I drink an energy drink, sometimes I don't. I think I'm gonna do an energy drink today. And it's all personal preference, you know, on what you wanna do. I'm gonna do my favorite flavor. I am in the Nissan Alti today because I have to get another one of my tires replaced in the back because I ended up running over an industrial staple. Just finished my banana. Mm -hmm, honey. One good girl is worth a thousand bitches. year i'm always striving to just overall better my health physical health internal health as well as just my mental health take a step back really analyze set your intentions straight setting your intentions from the beginning especially within your fitness journey is so important the reason why you are doing what you are doing continuously focus on working on your relationship with food we need food to fuel our bodies and at the end of the day that is what is most important i am eating this specific way because one i I enjoy it which is the most important thing is I always want to enjoy what I eat I'm eating high protein foods which keep me fuller for longer as well as help me reach my overall fitness goals but I also don't restrict I've never been the type to fully restrict anything to the point where it's gotten really toxic with my relationship with food love to track my protein because I want to make sure that I'm getting in a certain amount of protein by the end of the day especially right now since I am purposefully trying to gain weight if I don't keep track I will fall off track very easily because I have trouble just getting in my food sometimes because I get so busy especially right now with the holidays things get so hectic girls I've been using the lifesome app to track my protein intake goals for a few years now and I'm actually so excited because they reached out to me to sponsor this video so thanks so much lifesome for sponsoring today's video I've been using lifesome to intentionally track my protein and I've been using them since like back in the day girl since before they rebranded when they had all of the cute little doodles and everything having an app where i can just scan my food the protein and servings right there makes it so freaking easy i'm still on this weight gain journey I consume anywhere between 130 to 140 grams of protein at the moment that's like the little window that i use because like i said i'm not like too strict so sometimes i will be over that sometimes i will be under it life some really helps me keep track of all of that stuff my favorite feature like i said on the app is the scanning feature where you scan your food and it instantly gives you 
all of the details, gives you the micronutrients, the calories, everything. I love that feature. That has been my favorite feature since I started using the app. They have so many other great features. You can also track your water. Now they also have a lot of really good, healthy, yummy meals that you can look up. Um, so if you ever need some inspo, they definitely have you on that. With all of that being said, girl, on a whole ass tangent, I'm going to finish my energy drink. Make sure to download the Lifesome app and purchase the premium version with my 50% off discount code. I'll have the link down below. I got new headphones. The reason why I got these is because they go over my ears so they don't hurt my earrings. Also, because they're silver. I love silver. Two, I was debating whether to get these or the Apple headphones, but the Apple headphones make you look so flat. Like I need some. the full workout for you guys that isn't the purpose of this video but i hope you guys enjoyed that little snippet you guys i'm looking back at these clips and i'm so shook at my glute progress like what this weight gain it's coming in hot and we're just getting started Damn, did my gym be playing some good ass music There is one really quick thing I want to mention. One thing that I had trouble with along my weight gain journey is building up my hunger levels and actually wanting to eat. Other times I would eat, but I was never hungry or like I would get super full super quick. It's slowly build up your food with time and don't try to go all in the very beginning when you're trying to gain weight what i suggest is always going the slowly but surely route and building up your meals with time with that being said we're gonna make a yogurt bowl something super quick something super easy something that i love to have on the regular especially on super busy days we're going to need a high protein yogurt Iggy's plant-based coconut blend yogurt. These are so good. I honestly recommend waiting to find them on sale because you can find them on sale regularly at Whole Foods and like those type of stores. Paying full price for these yogurts is like it's ridiculous because there's no way I'm gonna pay $2 for this little tub you got me so fucked up. I do wanna try a whey protein because a lot of my fellow EHP athletes say that whey vanilla ice cream, I think it, that's what it is, is really good, but I haven't tried it. Grab your favorite protein, grab your favorite yogurt, grab some fruit. I just love to use frozen fruit because it's the easiest and it never goes bad. A banana. I put my hand on. Oh shit, that was fucking. Some hemp seeds. If you don't want to do hemp seeds, if you don't like hemp seeds, you can also do 
chia seeds, you can do nuts. For texture purposes, you might need a little bit of milk. I use a non-dairy milk. Leafa Farms Protein Oat Milk, and it has eight grams of protein per serving, so I'll probably do like one serving of this. Very high protein, very yummy, and super easy to make. It takes me like at most five minutes to make. The vanilla one specifically is so good. For texture purposes, estimate about one serving of that. But I'm stupid. I don't mind the ugly banana. To make it that much better, if I had granola, I would use granola, but I'm gonna add some cereal. Here is my pretty yogurt bowl. I don't have the barcode for hemp seeds. I'm just typing in three tablespoons of hemp seeds. Meal number two, 93 grams of protein. That's what I'm freaking talking about, period. Gonna give it a good little mix. I'm gonna give this a taste test really quick for you guys. Super good, super easy. Like I said, you can alter this in so many ways. Customize it to whatever you are feeling in the moment. And um, yeah. I'm already at 93 grams of protein for the day, and this is only my second meal of the day. So we're on a good ass start. I'm gonna shower in a sec. No me vayan a decir nada. I'm gonna prep my veggies that I'm gonna roast. I believe these are Japanese papas. I'm gonna share this with Johnny. Doing roasted veggies like this is a really good idea if you're into meal prepping because the veggies will last you so long. Downside to cooking at home. This aqua collagen from EHP Labs helps me meet my protein goals as well as helps me get in my collagen. So I'm going to take two scoops of this. I'm going to put this under snack category. I'm at 113 grams of protein. Hyped. guys that your progress is never going to be linear there will always be obstacles that get into your way because that's just life whatever type of goals you may have that revolve around wellness relatively healthy eating and all of that you have to be so patient with yourself because things will always get in your way 
And coming from me, I'm very open with you guys when stuff gets in my way. You literally cannot let a little bump in the road stop you from continuing to work on your goals. It's just part of life, part of the journey, and it's part of just this lifestyle. Just be patient with yourself. Try your best to not compare yourself to anybody else. Keep your eyes on the prize. Keep your eyes on you. Focus on you. Focus on how you can improve your life. Accept that shit happens and keep it moving. Just try again tomorrow. But just remember to hold yourself accountable and actually try. If you say you're gonna do something, keep that promise to yourself. Anyways, I'm gonna shower. <laughs> veggies are done so I want to have some sugar snap peas as a snack Because I've already reached my protein goal, I hit 158 grams of protein, which is nuts. I'm so juiced. My mom gave me a cake the other day, so I'm gonna have some cake. I'm gonna take a little bit of a break, and then I'm gonna go from there, and then I'll obviously show you guys what I end up having. <laughs> track my protein because if not I'll just eat carbs all day all day every day my hair is almost done drying and I'm gonna go to bed super soon so as you can see there's my protein carbs and fats and like I said I did not track everything but there's a little summary my day was so funny because every time I vlog it's always raining 